Hi, this is Cecilia from Tarot by Cecilia, and today is Friday, January 12th, 2024. The Tarot card for today is the Seven of Cups, and this one is from the Illustrated Fox Tarot by artist Taylor High. And don't forget to listen to all of my special tarot guidances available for 2024, including the general and your sun signs, available on my website, Patreon, and YouTube. Now, sometimes when we see this card, we <laughs> we might need a reality check. We might need to look out for scammers. We might need to, you know, not be just wishful thinking. But there's a whole lot more that's going on right now, isn't there? I'll admit, today's Aquarius moon could have some of you, you know, attracted by bright and shiny things, right? Which is a little bit of a distraction. But when I look at this overall for the majority of you, what I feel here is more about the big picture, all right? Because with this card come a lot of options. And sometimes it's not easy to choose, right? We want to know what's behind door number three, that kind of a thing. But we have an excellent, excellent aspect happening today with Mars in its exalted sign of Capricorn trining Jupiter in Pisces, which happens to be a money sign. So if you, you know, are working on these kind of things, you'll be able to see the big picture better, be able to go after what you want. You had that really nice new moon in Capricorn to make those intentions. Maybe you're looking for a better job. Maybe you're looking for more clients. This is the time to be focused on it. And Mars is all about, you know, that passion and drive and energy, the courage even, right? So what do you want? Some would say with this card, perhaps you don't know, but my feelings on this are that Everybody has things that they're trying to get worked out. This might not be exactly about what you want down the line, but what you need to do to get there to make it happen. And that is also very important because right now we're still waiting on Mercury to get out of Sagittarius, get out of shadow once it leaves on the 20th and it'll be moving into Capricorn tomorrow which will be very helpful to you and honestly with each passing day there should be more clarity there should be more drive there should be the ability to look at all of those things before you and what you want and to start to make a move but like I said with what you already know with what you're already doing you know that's kind of the key until Mercury gets past that shadow date on the 20th. And we are going to hit a totally retrograde free zone later in the month, so stay tuned for that, because it will be very important in your, you know, moves that you're making to go forward. So do be mindful of what is real and what is not, and what is realistic and what is not, and manage your options responsibly. I want to thank you all very much for being here. I'll see you here again tomorrow. And as always, have a great day.